Betfred, proud sponsor of the World Snooker Championship. Dave, this is quite some run and quite some story. That's fa fantastic. It's fantastic for me uh, and everyone that's ever helped me, you know. I hope everyone back at the snooker club back home uh, are, all, are all buzzing too. Was it hard to keep your emotions in check today because you came out the favourite at 10-6, but Kyron came back from 6-1 down against Barry Hawkins, so you couldn't take those last few frames for granted? Yeah, you know Kyron's going to battle like mad and uh, try and come back at you at some point. Uh, went out there feeling great. Uh, probably probably got thought about it a bit too much at times and probably got a bit tense rather than just remembering to enjoy it like I've been all week and uh, just get my head down and try and pop the balls and what what will be will be but uh, delighted to get over the line yeah you've been in two ranking finals this season but but surely in the context and and with the prize of the single table setup that's got to be the biggest win of your career I don't know if it, being Kyron there was the biggest win of my career but certainly uh, you're probably right Getting to the semi-final of the World Championships is probably the best thing that's happened to me in snooker. Do you think all those years ago when you were scratching around and things weren't quite clicking, do you think you would have believed it if someone had come up to you and said, listen, mate, keep trying because one day you'll be putting these potatoes down and you'll be picking up 100 grand and walking down the stairs for the one table set up at the cruise? I'd have said you're raving mad, mate. Yeah, no, no chance. No, no way did I ever think that. I always thought I could make a living and I, and I, I guess I kind of said to myself that's it I'm, I've got in a 32 I can make a living it's better than it's, it's it's a bit easier than working and kind of uh, just thought that was it for me so to, to make a big a bit of a push this year and kick on you know feels fantastic there are parallels with your passage to the last four and and, and those of Gary Wilson it, this, this, these are important messages being sent out for younger players who might be struggling for form and struggling for money that if they keep plugging away and keep working and keep believing great days might one day happen. So what you're doing is not just important for you, but it's important for the next generation of players who haven't quite yet made the breakthrough. Yeah, I don't worry about age being a number. You know, I'm 37. I'm an old dog now. Um, I should be retiring, but I feel, you know, I keep myself fit and healthy. And uh, But with the, big, the biggest difference, Barry Earn taking over, you know, when, when I was a young lad, 20, 21, whatever, there was hardly any game. Um, so I didn't give it the respect it deserves and didn't try my best, you know. So it's, only, it's only really been the last two or three years that I've really tried to put everything into it. Um, and obviously, I've made changes this year, getting a coach and all that, uh, which, which have been another push. But the young lads should definitely, definitely realise that they're very lucky with the opportunities they have right now. And, uh, yeah, if they, if they want it, they've got to go and earn it because, you know, that's what, that's what I've done and that's, I'm sure that's what Gary's done as well. Will you be able to enjoy it tomorrow or will you be too focused on trying to win the match? I'd like to think I'm going to enjoy every moment of it, you know, but uh, I think just getting a frame on the board to begin with and settle down and get into the match. But uh, yeah, yeah, for four sessions or whatever it is, you know, these are long matches. I'm not used to these kind of things. So it is quite hard to concentrate and focus for that long, but uh, we'll certainly give it a go. Betfred, proud sponsor of the World Snooker Championship.